everyone, Amy Love here, and I am coming on today to share with you a very special swap I received from my friend Julie Kay, who is Paper Play, Paper Play with Julie Kay on YouTube, and I of course have a link to Julie's channel below. Julie and I, for the past few years, have been doing a Christmas swap, which I always enjoy, Julie, so thank you so much for swapping with me. And of course, she spoils me rotten and the box is too big for me to put um, up here. So I'm going to bring it up piece by piece. But when I opened the box, it had this lovely, like it's a really big, so I'm not sure if it was like a placemat. It's probably like a table scarf. It's beautiful. I absolutely love it. And I will be putting it in my house somewhere. This is not for snippity snip. This is for keeping. <laughs> This is for hoarding. So thank you, Julie, I love it, it's beautiful. And of course she had a lovely handmade card. I absolutely love her handmade cards. I always send her a store-bought card and I just, I feel like a loser <laughs> because she always sends me a really great handmade card. Julie, thank you, thank you so much. I have um, many of her cards actually around my craft room. I enjoy them so much. So everything in here looks wrapped in beautiful eyelet, which you know I love so much, so I'm excited. Thank you for sharing the eyelet. I can't wait to play. And this is like wrapped up like a piece of candy. How cute is this? Absolutely adorable. And look at this adorable ribbon. Um, what are they called? The insertion lace that's also eyelet. I love this. Thank you so much for sharing. I love how you use that. Um, I am playing Christmas music in the background because I am feeling Christmas today. I just got home from work and my husband is at Bible study tonight. So I get to have a cup of hot cocoa with a candy cane, listen to some Christmas music and open my beautiful swap from Julie. So I thought Christmas music was appropriate. Um, so I've got two pieces of this. I love this so much yes to that i actually already have some projects in mind and then let's see what's in here oh all right some bubble wrap and then oh my gosh look at this bag she made i need to make a pile of the bubble wrap so i can keep it this is so cute it looks like it was like a battenberg hanky maybe i don't know it looks it's like a little pouch Okay, it's adorable, and so is that button. Love it. Oh my gosh, I love this, Julie. Did you sew this yourself? Oh my gosh, it's so well done. Okay, I'm loving this pouch. And it's, of course, full of goodies. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, handmade with love. I need this stamp. Thank you. I need one of those. Not anymore excited oh and some hand a handmade flower look how beautiful pink and puffy i love it i love that bling in the middle so cute love it oh look at this pink vintage seam binding it's the lace seam binding oh my gosh it's so cute i love and here is some uh pink seam binding oh my gosh it's beautiful <gasps> I almost hate to open those. And some vintage rickrack. Oh, love, love, love. And some gorgeous bling buttons. Gorgeous bling buttons. Oh my gosh, look at this. I swear, Julie, we have uh, the same ideas because I'm sure I sent you some bling hearts. <laughs> Maybe not this one exactly though, but I love it. I absolutely love that. Ooh, yes to the bling. Look at this piece. I can't wait to bling up the things. And then look at this beautiful tag. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, I love it. And it's like a, it's a wooden tag, I feel like. That is beautiful paper. It's very sturdy. I'm actually gonna hang this on the Christmas tree, Julie. Love it. And then, oh, look at this little, this is such a delicate little doily. And look at the beautiful colors. Did your mom make this, Julie? It's so pretty. Oh, I love it. I love it. And then some vintage um, ribbon roses. 
Uh, yes, please. In white. Oh, I love them. This is this is just amazing, this right here. Okay, I'm going to try to put everything back where I got it and then dispense it later. I love this. Absolutely beautiful. Right, let's get the things in the bag. Love the stamp. Thank you, my friend. All right, let's get that over there. Let's grab something else out of this giant box, Julie. <laughs> Here's another um, candy wrapped. I love it. I love it so much. With more of this insertion lace, which is very cool. Very cool. I love it. I've had her box for a few days, but I just wanted to wait until she received mine. And she got mine today. So I could wait to dig in. And tonight was the perfect night for it. So I am making a pile of those right here. And it is wrapped in something just beautiful again. Okay, let's see this. Oops. All right, I was gonna show you the outside, but we're gonna look at the inside first because look at these vintage spools. And look at this amazing lace she has on there. Look how wide this lace is. And it's such a beautiful pink color. And then she has got, uh, a snowflake charm holding it on. These are beautiful. I'm gonna leave them just like that and put them in a display basket. <gasps> so cute, I love them, Julie. And then on this one, there is this beautiful gathered scalloped eyelet, which she knows that I love eyelet. Eyelet is one of my favorites. And on this one is a pine cone, which I love the pine cone, isn't that cute? And then on this one, it has oh, such a pretty lace. That is a really, really pretty lace. Let me see if I can get two fingers under there so you can get a better look at it. Isn't that gorgeous? That is really, really pretty. And then this one has mittens. <laughs> Super cute, Julie. I love these. I can't wait to put these in a basket. It's gonna be so cute. And then there's this beautiful lace here. Let me show you that. Isn't that pretty? That is so pretty. I feel like the color isn't really coming across right on the screen, but it is really beautiful. And then this one has the snowflake charm. I love these spools, absolutely adore them. And then this one, oh, this is a great snippety snip lace. Look at this thing. Look at all the flowers on there. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love it. It's so cute. So cute. Okay, let me set those off to the side so we can look at the wrapper. Where am I gonna set these? Oh, I think right here we'll do. And this is like a, it's a curtain. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And it's such a pretty color. It's a really light cream color that oh that is a beautiful piece julie oh i love it absolutely love it all right let me move the eyelet let me make the appropriate piles over here <laughs> i love it all right let me grab another one and this is like a little sack that she made with the um the eyelet lace and it's uh got that insertion lace bow and then it's got a beautiful little uh, snowflake right there so sweet let's get that opened adorable let's see what we've got in here oh look at this all right this is the ornament because we one of the things we decided to swap was an ornament look at how beautiful this heart is i think there's a video for this on her channel i i remember seeing like i saw the clips um on some of her videos and i didn't purposely didn't watch them except the christmas trees she has a whole series on christmas trees i forget how many they are there are at least nine i think and she shows you how to make each christmas tree 
um, I was excited. So I did watch some of those. I don't know which Christmas tree I received yet though because one of the things, one of the other things we decided to swap was a Christmas tree. But all the ones she made was beautiful. So I'm excited to see which one I got. But I do believe I saw that there's a video for this. It feels like uh, maybe a paper mache heart. And look, look at that. It's so pretty. It has so many beautiful details. I love this butterfly. Put some flowers and the stamens, super cute. And then from the bottom, there is like this acrylic um, flower with a pearl drop. And then ribbon and pearls and some netting. Oh, oh. It's so cute, Julie. I love it. I can't wait to hang it on my tree. That's just going to be so beautiful. Oh my goodness. All right, let me set that right there. Absolutely gorgeous. And then here's a lovely pile of doilies, my sweet friend. I love how you send these to me each year. Like, I think I still have the ones pinned together that you sent me last year because <laughs> I just think they're so pretty the way they're pinned together and I don't want to use them. So I'm still hoarding those. But look at this piece. This is a beautiful, beautiful piece. Oh, I love that so much. And then this one, I'm so tempted to just cut out the individual doilies because it's hard to find doilies that small and sometimes I need them. Love. And then look at how pretty these are. Oh, they're just gorgeous. Oh, I love this oval one. Oh, so, so pretty. And this one, gorgeous. I love the shape of this one. That's really, really pretty. And then this one, look at that beautiful edging. Oh, these are gorgeous. Julie, thank you so much. Isn't that pretty? It's just, it's too pretty to take apart. I love it. I'm gonna set those right here. Get another drink. Mm. All right. Oh, I see these on the top, so I'm just going to grab them. Look at these appliques. Oh my goodness, these are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. <gasps> I love these. Look at these appliques. This one would be a great snippety snip one, too, because you could just do so much with those. Thank you for sharing, my sweet friend. And I love these for surrounding an image. So pretty. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, let's see what we've got here in this little one. It has more of the insertion lace and this adorable little, I don't know if you can see it. I think it's a snowman, but I don't think my camera will show it to you. I don't know. I'm always having cameras issue issues. Anyway, it's adorable little snowman. Which I think I have to unpin to untie this one. Yeah, super cute. You know, I put it on instrumental jazz and now all of a sudden I've got words. <laughs> so let me change that right now because I want just to hear instrumental jazz Christmas instrumental jazz that's what we're that's what we're look, going for that's the mood we're going for all right we'll see if that works any any other jazz fans out there I love me some jazz music especially when I'm crafting it's my favorite all right more of this beautiful lace put that right there Oh, and look at the embroidery on here. Beautiful. Thank you for this. You know, I love using these to make bags and envelopes. So cute. So let's see what's in here. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> Julie! I love it. It's a desk nameplate. And I actually am going to use this on my table at craft fairs. I love it. Julie, thank you so much. That's so cute. Of course, made with Scrabble tiles, but it's on one of those um, those Scrabble things that hold the letters. I mean, it's just so cute. 
Look at all the detail. It's so sweet. You know, leave it to me to not be able to find some Christmas music that is soothing. <laughs> Jazz instrumentals, what I want. Quiet Christmas in instrumentals. Let's, let's try that one. Let's see what happens. I love this. I love it so much, Julie. Thank you. That's precious. Oh, that's precious. Let's leave it sitting right there. It's, I love it. So cute. And then I've got this adorable little pink uh, drawstring bag. Oh, let's see this. Oh, oh, look at how pretty this is. It's like a pink and an off-white. Oh, oh, that's adorable. Oh, Julie, thank you so much for sharing. Oh, so cute. Oh, I'm so excited about that. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, I love it so much. And then I've got another little uh, gold drawstring bag. Oh, I love this trim. I love it. This beautiful <laughs> beaded trim. I, I am in love with this trim. And I am out of it. So thank you so much. Look at it. <gasps> oh, who doesn't love a beaded dangle trim? That is beautiful i can't wait to play with it and i feel like on the camera it's it doesn't look like the blush that it is these beads they're a little more blush in person i feel like they look a little more gold on the camera but they're beautiful oh julie thank you i can't wait to play with that love it All right here's another little pink drawstring bag with some more vintage pieces. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, love so much. Oh my gosh. That's gonna be fun to play with. Let me put all the little, make a little pile of drawstrings over there. I see a couple, or enough, or enough one more drawstring in there. this oh my gosh that is so cute oh I love this piece look at that that is beautiful Julie thank you so much for sharing <laughs> what fun oh look at all these goodies oh I got a wink of Stella brush Merry Christmas to me Oh, I haven't had one in so long. That's awesome. I can't even open it. There we go. <laughs> to add the shimmer shimmer to the projects. Yay. Thank you. I haven't had a Wink of Stella brush in a couple of years, so I'm very excited about that. Because you know how much I love to add the sparkle to the things. Oh, and she sent me a 10 to alter. I love it. Oh, and look at the little tiny um, oh, beaded trim. Oh, I love it. I wonder if you can see how. Yes, look at how pretty. Those are beautiful. Oh, I am excited to use these, Julie. Thank you so much. I'm also excited about the 10. I think I have a couple of these um, in my, I have a giant box of stuff to alter and that I'll probably never in my lifetime be able to alter all the things in the box. <laughs> I think I have a couple of these in there, but I'm going to leave this one on my desk so I actually get to altering it sooner. Hmm. All right, let's see what we've got here. Oh my gosh, how cute. Please give these onto the Christmas tree. What? Please give these. Well, you know what? I should have read my note. I had a note from her. Let me read it before I open all the things. 
because I don't remember what the note said. Let's see. Julie. Okay. Hmm. There's just a few instructions for my package. Okay, that's about the tree. Glue it on if you don't. Okay, I also had some other pieces that need to be added to the tree. Okay, and hot and uh, hot glued on, but I was worried that they might have broken off in transit. So you can glue them on when you get the tree. Okay, thank you. So these uh, glue to the tree. So I'm not gonna open this one until I open the tree. Okay, that one's for that one. And this says the base for the Christmas tree, please glue on. Okay, so here's the base for the tree that she made and some decorations for the tree. How exciting. So let me see. I'm going to assume this is the tree. So let me, let me make some room. Oh, how fun. Okay. I love this so much. Okay, let me scooch that over. Scooch it. I assume, I assume this is the tree. It has a cute little um, Christmas tree charm on there, which I need to unpin so I can untie the ribbon. More of this beautiful insertion lace and more beautiful eyelet fabric. I'm so excited. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh my goodness gracious. Oh. You know, this is not one of the trees I think I've seen over on her channel. Oh. It's beautiful. This is all beaded, heavily beaded um, appliques. I mean, I'm sure that my camera isn't showing you all the detail, but they are heavily beaded appliques and then rolled roses and pearls with this beautiful glitter star. It's just gorgeous. And look at the fringe. Look at the fringe on the bottom. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Can you see it? It's so cute. I love it so much. Okay, so let's see the stand for this beautiful, beautiful tree. Um, let me see here. Okay. It's in this um, vintage hanky, which I'm also excited about. All right. How fun is that? <laughs> Look at the spool. Oh, Julie, it's so cute. Julie, it really is so me. Thank you, sweet friend. Look at that. How cute is that going to be? <laughs> I'm never going to get it in. Oh. Yes, I just turned on my hot glue gun and I am going to just decorate this baby tonight so I can put it downstairs in my Christmas decorations. So let's see the ornaments or the decorations. Let me unpin this guy. Oh, I love this bell charm. It's so cute. And another um, little hanky. Let's see if I can get this one off. This way. We're getting there. We're getting there. All right. Oh, it's more of these heart tins. Love it. Let's see what we've got. Oh. Look at these doves. Oh my gosh. These are going to be precious. Oh my gosh. I am excited to put these on the tree. Oh, Julie, yes. <laughs> yes to those. Oh my gosh. There's so many. I can just cover it in doves. 
Yes, I'm going to. <gasps> that is going to be beautiful. That is what I'm doing tonight as soon as I am done with this video. I am excited about it. <laughs> Julie, have fun. Thank you so much. I am excited to put it together. I love it. All right, so I'm going to set it right here for now while I go through the rest of the box. I love this tree. Oh my goodness. Mm. Absolutely adorable. Oh, I see some chocolate. Yes. It came out of this beautiful little pink drawstring bag. Peanut butter and chocolate. Yes, please. <laughs> Love. All right, and now there's this, which is also beautifully, beautifully wrapped. I think in the other curtain from that other curtain panel she sent, which is awesome because now I've got both panels. So I might hang these in my craft room. Love it. Another um, cute Christmas charm. Love. Oh my gosh, this is a nice long piece of this. Oh, exciting. Okay. Let's see what we've got here. And this is the other um, curtain panel. I think I'm going to hang these in my craft room. I'm so excited. Thank you, Julie. Look at these. Look at these. Okay, let's check it out. Oh. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh, these are awesome. They're piano rolls. Oh, Julie, that's so sweet. Thank you so much. So she sent two. Look at these vintage boxes. So much yes to this packaging. Right? And here's another one. Oh my goodness. Thank you, sweet friend. Love these. Yay. All right, and then I've got one more, but this one is kind of a big. I don't think I'm gonna have room, actually. I mean, look at this thing. I can't even fit it in there. That's how big it is. It has this adorable um, snowflake charm. So let me take that off first. Put that right there. And then more of the beautiful insertion eyelet, which I'm very excited about. This one is a really long piece. Love. And then a nice big piece of this um, eyelet fabric love oh it's my box that's right I forgot that we also did a box my memory though and look at how big this box is Julie my goodness and then we didn't discuss the size of the box oh my god this is beautiful Julie this is beautiful okay I just want to stand up this is gorgeous this is from the Stamperia paper that we both love. <laughs> and look at all the details. One of these beaded dangle flowers I love. Oh, this slides out. Oh, I'm so, this is so cute. I love this. She's got um, a tassel right there. I mean, it's beautiful. Look at it. Oh, it's absolutely beautiful. And look at the side. I love this ruffle and then this beautiful dangle. Can you guys see that? Beautiful dangle. And then, oh my gosh, look at the feet, y'all. Look at the feet. They are spools with beautiful trim wrapped around them. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Julie, that's adorable. This is a completely adorable box and then this slides out <laughs> I 
I'm so excited. Look at all the appliques she shared, right? So in this one, it's this beautiful flower with all the pearls inside. And then look at the bottom. Oh, I love it. Oh, this is just beautiful. And then look at this applique with this dimensional flower. Absolutely gorgeous. And then this one has um, the little pearl center. Oh, little pearls. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Julie, I love them. Look at this. I love them all, but this box is stunning. Julie, this box is stunning. I just, it's so, it's so beautiful. Like, oh my goodness. Everybody get in your spots. <gasps> Julie, I love it so much. Julie, thank you for swapping with me. You're so talented. Everything is so absolutely beautiful. I love it. You guys make sure you go over and check out um, Julie's channel if you haven't already. Uh, I hope you're all having a Merry Christmas. I am going to settle down and decorate this guy right now. I love it, love it. And... Um, I hope you're all having a really Merry Christmas, and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, everybody. Thanks again, Julie.